Hey everyone, here's how to do a five minute pencil drawn plan from a SketchUp model. Starting with your SketchUp model, create a section plane where you'd like the plan to be done. Then a line view, parallel projection. Zoom in to the extent that you want the plan to show. Now in styles, make your back color white. Now do file, export, 2D graphic, and call this layer one. Save it as a JPEG. Now in styles, turn on profiles, thickness one, turn on extensions, endpoints, and jitter. Now do file, export, 2D graphic again, and save this as layer two. Now open both layers in Photoshop. Put them both onto the same document. Now move the layer two to the top. And blending mode set to multiply. Now we need to get a texture of a pencil sketch effect. So go onto Google and type pencil sketch textures. This one looks good. Now paste it into your Photoshop document. And now scale it to the size of the pencil sketches that you would like. After doing this, make sure that the pencil texture covers the whole width of the plan. Set the blend mode to overlay and drop the opacity until you get something which looks about correct. Create a new layer. Now select with the magic wand, the walls. And do a solid fill. Drop the opacity until it looks a light gray or whichever shade you would like. Now let's add some shading and light to the furniture and the windows. Use a levels adjustment layer to adjust the thickness and density of the pencil sketch. Now using the marquee tool, select the area in front of your main pieces of furniture. And using a layer mask on the levels, we will start to show the levels adjustment in this area in front of the sofa. As a result, the pencil sketch will become darker, giving the illusion of shadows. Now repeat this for other pieces of furniture. Now for lighting from the windows, create a new layer and draw a rectangular marquee around the area in front of your window. Select the paintbrush tool and use a white brush. Click in front of the window to create a soft lighting effect. Change the blend mode to overlay. And that's it.